The following portion of Ozark's Fox AM is sponsored by Art Cambridge Financial. Do you have questions about life insurance? Because I know I do, because I don't know much about it, and I can't think of a better person to talk to than Art Cambridge at Cambridge Financial Services. I gotta ask you a question. Yes, sir. When should you get life insurance? Uh, the younger the age, mm-hmm. the better. And the reason that it's better, number one, you're in probably better health. And number two, the costs are less when you're younger. As you age, obviously, health situations develop. And every year that you age, the cost of the policy, the premiums, will go up. Mm-hmm. Uh, obviously, at, at uh, 25 or 30, uh, they're much less expensive than you're looking at 50 or 60. Uh, then you also, uh, if you buy a house, you know, and you got a $250,000 mortgage, you know, that's not chicken feed. Mm-hmm. So uh, most generally when you're buying those larger policies, you're looking at, at a term policy. Uh, and normally you're looking at one to finish off your mortgage, like if your mortgage is 20 or 25 or 30, you can buy that term policy to protect you through that whole period of time. Uh, Many times uh, protecting your income is the other part of that. Now, I would normally look at buying term when you're younger, and the reason for that is you're not making as much money as you normally would when you're 50, and you're raising your family, so the cost of everything uh, is correlated where it costs more money. Uh, In term, a lot of times, is all that you can afford. Mm -hmm. Uh, Now, somewhere in between there, we should be looking at a universal life, which is a combination of term and whole life, where you can adjust your premiums up or down depending on your financial uh, capabilities, or whole life, which is the most expensive. Now, a lot of times when you get into your 60s and 70s, people look at burial policies or that type of insurance. And one of the gimmicks from TV is sometimes those policies end at 85 or 90. You have to make sure that that policy is going to last, Mm. you know, if you live to be 95. Gotcha. So is there there an age where you're maybe too old to get life insurance? You know you said start young, but can you still get it at 60, 65, 70? Sure, yes. And, And even if you have bad health. A lot of times the bad health policies won't go into effect for two years. What they do is they'll pay your premiums back plus 10% interest for the first two years and then in the third year it goes into full effect. Mm -hmm. Uh, And those policies are much more expensive obviously because of the health issue. It's like I had a lady the other day that somebody, not me, sold her a policy at 80 some years old and she's been paying on it for 10 years and she's paid in almost as much money as the policy's death benefit is. And she's in reasonably good health. We actually cashed the policy and she didn't need the policy to begin with Mm. because she had plenty of money. But, you know, that's here nor there. She fell for somebody telling her she needed a burial policy and I just told her to go down to the funeral home and pick out her what she wanted to do and write a check. Right. That seems smart. And that's what I love about you, Art, is you are really here. You're ingrained in the community. You've been here for many, 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 many years, and you really do care about the people here. And I appreciate that. If, If somebody is 25 or 65 and they're watching today and they want more information about life insurance and how you can help them. What's the best way to get in touch with you? Just uh, call me, 417-869-1300, and uh, uh, talk to my assistant or talk to me, and and, uh, we'll set an appointment, and then you can come in, and I'll just visit with you Mm -hmm. about what you're trying to do and what you're trying to accomplish, Uh, and then I'll uh, have you come back in after I put together some Mm -hmm. numbers, and then we just go from there. And it's that simple. That's simple and it's fairly easy. Yeah, if you want somebody you can trust, who's looking out for you and can get you the best policy, give Art Cambridge a call today. Thanks so much, Art, good to see you. Thank you, Jeremy.
The preceding portion of Ozark's Fox AM was sponsored by Art Cambridge Financial.